structures inserted into the fibular head The posterolateral corner is a hot topic in sports medicine and also in trauma. It is restrained to external rotation and posterior translation of the tibia in conjunction with the PCL. Isolated injury to the posterolateral corner is rare. You want to make sure you identify the injury and you repair it or you reconstruct it. Otherwise, the reconstruction of the ACL or PCL will fail. Posterolateral corneal injury is usually diagnosed by the dial test. So what is the arrangement of insertion of the structure on the latter side on the head of the fibula? The most anterior one is the lateral collateral ligament, which arises from the lateral femoral condyle, and it is proximal and posterior to the popliteus tendon insertion. It is superficial to the popliteus tendon. The popliteus goes from the back posteriorly underneath the ligament to reach the lateral femoral condyle anterior and distal to the lateral collateral ligament. The lateral collateral ligament is the most anterior structure that inserts on the fibular head, followed by the popliteofibular ligament, which comes from the popliteus down into the fibular head. The biceps is the most posterior structure inserted into the fibular head with the common perineal nerve posterior to it. So here is the arrangement of the structures again. The first structure anteriorly on the fibular head is the lateral collateral ligament, followed by the popliteal fibular ligament, the biceps. Be aware that the common perineal nerve is posterior to the biceps. Be aware the most posterior structure inserted into the fibular head is the biceps. This video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.